Um, hello guys, uh, it's your boy man under the goat as you all know me. So guys, um, I'll be doing the market breakdown and eh? like people have been asking me to do the market breakdown. So I'll be doing the market breakdown guys from the, um, you know, like from currencies to indices, you know, guys, so I dedicate this video to like every hustler out there who's trying by all means, you know, who's getting motivated by my videos. And like uh, guys, uh, you can share my page, you know, like I believe you're gonna reach 10,000 um, subscribers not so long. So guys, um, okay, when I analyze first, I start at the highest height and I come to what to the lowest low. So now I have the highest height and I have the lowest low. So most of the time, I love to focus on the current structure, you know. Okay, this is the current structure. And I say current structure, I don't want to be analyzing things that already happen, you know. Even though, like, it does help, you know, it does, it does. I can't say it doesn't help, it does help. Uh, but then, like, sometimes I just feel like it's it's good um, analyzing from, like, the current structure, having the current structure. So, from the weekly, I'm going to go to the daily. You understand? So, this is the daily, guys. Um, If you can check on the daily, we're forming a sort of a pattern, you know. But then for now, like, I can't say yeah, the market is going this direction, the market is going that direction, you know. It's too early. So on the daily, I see that, okay, there's nothing that we can do, you know. So we're going to move to the what? You're going to move to the 4-hour. You understand, guys? So on the 4-hour, you can see that, okay, all the market was moving. You could see, even if we were to go to that other side, it's still nah. So, okay, guys, um, when it's like this, we'll have this trend line here. That's the reason the market is buying. It's one two this is the third touch you understand guys so the third touch you have to like always expect something when it comes to the market again it's something like this you know so always when it's like these guys you know one two i guess we're gonna go for the third touch you know so it can be nice if you can check guys uh guys like knowing your like the analysis does help guys you know like not depending on anyone when it comes to analysis like if you could like chase the skill everything will come and like just choose the skill work on the skill you know because like everyone say forex is easy this thing is not that like it's not easy to be honest like i don't think it's easy if like forex was easy everyone would like have been like made it you know like everyone would be making gang money and stuff you know okay so i don't think forex is easy so now i'm on my what i'm on my third touch you know so i trade this thing uh, as simple as that you know guys uh, did you check all the setup it was like, I just entered the setup because of a few confirmations. So I was on the four hour. I have to head to the one hour. So you see on the one hour, I'm going to focus on the current structure. You understand? I don't care what the market does. Like, I only care about what happens now. You know, because I've seen it happening before. I know. Check, guys. I'll use the bar pattern, you know. I use the bar pattern most of the time. Okay, I'll just take this... Uh, um, you see you see how it is guys i just took that the previous market at the bar pattern and like when i come here it makes sense you know guys so that's how it is like that's how i kill those things you know i've seen them happening before like if it happened before it can like also happen now when you go to the m15 you get your entry your entry was supposed to be here you know so now we know that we are heading there Do you understand so that's how easy it is guys once you see those things you can't unsee them understand guys you can't unsee them yes yeah, so, so that was um cat chf for you guys uh, that was cat chf for you guys so now i'm gonna go to another pair let's check okay we have usd cat uh on the usd cat all right usd cat i had it guys uh it was like this so it played out last week so i had a buy from here so now i'm having sell but i'll also show you how i got it so um, here's the usd card so on the usd card as i said i'll start on the white i'll start on the weekly so now we are on the weekly guys uh this is the lowest low and okay again on the weekly we have the we have to have what the highest height you know i don't know it's like i feel like my net tag is low but then that's all we have it like you know we have the structure guys you know so I'm a person of focusing on the current structure most of the time, you see. Because, like, it's easy to analyze the previous market. Like, uh, it's a challenge analyzing the current market, you know. Previous market, man, like, everyone can do that, you know. Like, I was on the weekly, guys. So now I just have to switch from the weekly to the day one. You understand? Uh, from the weekly to the day one. 
Okay, from the weekly to the day or from the weekly. All right, okay, from the weekly to the day one. So when I'm on the day one, guys, you can see that, ah, man, like ch chats are nice, guys. I can't care if you see on the, on the, on the, on the day life having something like this, you know. So when I have something like this on the daily, I'll try to figure it out and how I'm going to analyze this thing, you know. You can see you have the lowest low, you know, guys. The market is challenging sometimes, you know. Like, it, does, it just needs you to be creative, you know. Just, like, think and, like, take those risks, you understand, guys. See how I have it now. And I'm just going to zoom in. And I'm going to zoom in, analyze the market inside, you see. So I'll just analyze these, you understand. I'll just analyze that. Then, like, from the... Then I'll move to the 4 hour, which is the 240 minutes. So this thing is, when it comes to minutes, it's like that, you see. So, the reason of us selling, like it's understandable. I know why, you understand, guys. Like, I know why we're selling. And I'll explain, you know, because, like, if you can check, guys, from the upper level on the trend line, when we came down, we came down at the what? We came down with an impulse, you understand? We came down at an impulse. You see how I have it, guys. We came down with what? We came down at an impulse. And if you can check, it was the first touch, second touch, third touch. It means the market respects what? Respects the third touch. You know, like the third touch has to be always the winner, man. Like I love the third touch more than I love anything because, like, they make my trading simple, you know. Like, if you just have that one strategy, you know that's going to work out, then you have it. Then, like, kill the market, you know, one, two, three. On the third touch, market went down with an impulse. After an impulse, as you all know, we have to have a what? We have to have a correction. Now, you understand, guys? That's all the strategy is. Impulse, you understand? Again, guys, we, we, went, we went into the same situation, you know? So, this one was the larger flag. I hope you understand. This one was the larger flag. The market has to give us another impulse. You understand, guys? So, like, this is a selling market. I'll now go to the... 60 minutes which is the one hour so on the one hour guys you can also see again on the one hour that ah, this thing is a selling market to understand like you just have to identify those things guys this is a selling market so this is a selling market so in this selling market i can get these one i can just take a trend line from there there's a nice breakout so that breakout that's how i determine my thing my 90 percent rule so if i were to sell this one Okay, let's say I see. Uh, okay, let's go for a sell. So from there, I'll be taking uh, my profit somewhere around this level because of the current structure. I was in it, this thing, I analyzed it last week, and I see it's dropping nice, you know, guys, it's dropping nice. So, okay, let's not forget the M15, you know, like the beast, the beast on confirmations, you understand, guys? So, like, if you saw this thing on the M15, Okay, uh, like I could have like taken it in a form of a what of a risk entry, or if it's not the risk entry, I would have like used the reduced, you know, because this one here was the what was the reduced risk entry. Understand, sir? If it was the reduced risk entry, you see how it is, you see how it dropped, guys. Like this thing, it's all in the mind. Like once you see them in your mind, like you can't unsee them, you know. So this is how we had it. So you can just go to the larger time frame and like you can like hold on the larger time frame, you see. So now I'm on the larger scale, which is the four hour. It was a one hour. Yeah, but then you can see how it dropped, guys. Like once you see them, you can't unsee them, guys, you know. Like you just have to just grab the skill after grabbing the skill. Then like you're good. So now let's go to another one. So that was um USD kit for you guys. So now I'm into AUD, um, AUD and ZD. So this is my AUD and ZD. I'll start my analysis again, as you know, on the weekly, guys. But then this weekly thing, I only use it on Sunday. But then for beginners, it's good to use it. So as you can see, you have your lowest low and you have your highest height. So this is the lowest low and the highest side. And if you can check now, we're in the current market. Where's the third touch, you know? On the current market, is the third touch. So we go to the what? We go to the daily. 
and then so I'll be taking these set up because of what because of the third touch and as I always say you guys I always repeat the same thing like the third touch that's where you need to know that okay the market is promising you know so yeah, I'm always taking my trades you understand because one um two It's like two and this one here guys is my last touch the third touch you know as you know the third touch is the what is the probability you know setup like the chances of the setup like happening it's very high and then again like i'll take a what the trend line from this touch one two again you're on the third 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 third, 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 third touch you know so we could say price is supporting that and this thing guys so like price is supporting that so from the daily i'll go to the four hour so when i'm in the four hour again guys um you can see we 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 are looking at this one like here we have nice um setup okay so here um before guys i took it in a form of a what in a form of a break which is it's there you know you can like you can't kill it like it's there so if you can check it's a break and like you need to stick to your strategy it's a break retest understand so after the retest you know that okay you have to do what you have to go long so our predictions on this one guys um it's still a buy i won't be changing my predictions on it it's still a buy so that's my target level on this one and like guys you should always have a tight stop loss you know stop loss helps so you see where i'll be taking my profit so i'll go to the one hour and like see what's happening in the one hour you know in the one hour the market still guys um i still have the same setup you know like i trust my analysis a lot you know like when i do my analysis i come back after a week to check how they played out you know so that's one step to like consist like to be consistent in the market because if you don't check then it means there's no progress but if you're checking there is progress you know like just check how many you got right how many you didn't then this thing is uh here a lot will just happen i don't know how to say here but then a lot will just happen but then remember here we're having what we're having our positions as a form of what of buys you understand why because of the structure like most of the time when i'm trading i just respect the structure you know that's me i don't know why like i respect the structure more than anything so this case was um whatever it is it is aud and ZD. And I say whatever it is, guys, I'm not a fan of currencies, you know. I'm not a fan of currencies. But then this one looks clean. AUD, um, NZD. You know, guys, like, after I analyze, just go to your chats. And then, like, it will come talk to me, you know. So even this one, I heard it, guys. So just explain on how I got this one. Okay, yeah. Uh, now we're starting on the daily. You're tired of going to the weekly. Well, there's nothing you need to check there. You understand so like uh the highest height of this thing it was here the lowest low it was here so i had my highest height and my lowest low and again guys if you can check that there's a head and shoulder setup you understand there's a head and shoulder setup yeah so on this time frame the daily i can't say i'll analyze i'll go to the four hour in this case you know so and i'm in the four hour guys you can see that okay we had a nice structure here and after that nice structure market broke price broke that level to understand so when price breaks a certain level it's now forming a what a correction you know like it's simplest terms when it comes to trading you know like it's trading made simple guys to understand like when trading is made simple this is what's gonna happen you see how it is so like it goes with what kind of a trader are you like i'm a risk enter risk um risk entry trader you know so i'll be taking my positions there and like we have those who are reduced risk entries you understand like i don't really go with the reduced man you know so if you're trading reduced risk entries it means you'll be taking your position somewhere around these uh levels you know so that's not where i'm gonna be taking my positions you understand so here yeah, guys uh, my prediction is gonna happen next i believe that okay you see the impulse we went down with because this is a selling market this impulse here 
I feel like it should be the impulse that will come to the current market. You see, when we take it from there, it forms a much like you can see how it moves. Okay? So I believe you can like reach this level. And like once you reach that level, all of a sudden you're like, what does KGP you are, you see? So just waiting for this thing to form, man, like because it has been forming, you understand? And like guys, yeah, I'm not even scared, you know. I know what's going to happen. I know the market will drop. Even if it doesn't drop now, but then I know, but okay, total overall of this thing, it's a selling market, you know. So if you're buying here, yeah, guys, just buy um for, for, for what you call, just buy short, you know, like just buy knowing that, okay, anytime you can like, anything can happen, you know. So just buy, you're using that mindset of like anything can like happen, you know. So sometimes, guys, um, I sometimes don't stick to my strategies, the way I draw my trend line, like I already know what's there, what's not there. So if you sometimes don't understand my uh, trend lines, don't, don't be surprised. That was um CAD GPU, I guess. So now I'm into CAD CHF. Yeah, so CAD CHF, we're going to start on the daily. Yeah, guys, the daily is nice, guys. I won't lie, you know. So on the daily, guys, you can see that we have a structure. You know, I can take it from there. It's nice, you know. Even on the lowest blue, I could do the same thing. Uh, like, this, this is nice, guys. You know? And, like, I'll highlight the important level that I have, which is this one, you know, where, like, price is usually to reach. And then, like, you have these thing. Yeah, this is the lowest low. And we have um, these, yeah. And I'll go to the four hour. You see, on the four hour, price is giving me... Um, that my type of mindset that you know what I'm still gonna continue going up, you know. So if you, even if it goes up, like you just need to know that okay, it's not a an up which you could say this is an up that I'll need. This is an up that will nah, you understand? Guys, because like you have like gone to you know, I could like just take it like this. This is a double bottom to me, you know, like because I know my chance. But then, to be honest, these will be a selling market because of the impulse correction and impulse. I believe we can just go up a little bit. Okay, let me go to the one hour. Even on the one hour, guys, you know, I feel like we just have to um, come reach that level again. Okay, let me do these. Let me take the lower one. Okay, it's like that. So I feel like guys, uh, we can expect something like this going up, you understand? So like, if we can like hit up, like we're gonna reach this level, you see? If we reach this level, that's, that's when we can like say, well, that's when you can say we are selling, you understand? Guys? So these are the buying opportunities, you know? Like, yeah, I'll buy it. I wouldn't sell it. I'll buy it. Yeah, so now I'll go to the M15 and let's see in the M15. M15 might be uh, creating a good structure. Okay, if you can check guys on the M15. Um, okay, there's a break here. Yeah? You know, so I'll be taking that break, you know, understand? Like, ah, man, a deep break, you know, it's a signal. We're going long, you understand, guys? Like, you just need to, like, make trading look easy, you understand? I know it's not easy. But then the way like we we analyze is we're trying to simplify everything so that like when it comes to the next person you know he or she like they have a better understanding on what's gonna happen you understand guys you just have to like push higher till that level then you can sell from that level so guys um and if it happens you don't understand some things you can ask on the what do you call you can ask on the comment section you can like don't be scared to ask guys you know because ish like not asking can like get you killed or get you in the wrong side of the market you know so i'm that person who always ask you know i don't look down on other niggas you know we just push work you know guys it's like i'm recording these videos what time is it i think it's 5 a.m i'm like busy recording and then when we make it you guys will be saying ah oh, no, it's not forex. It is forex. I'm up this time, guys. Yeah. Understand it? I'm up this time doing my work, you know. Doing what I'm good at, you understand? I, I believe everyone was born with their own gift. If it's a gift, this is my gift. I yeah. understand? Okay, guys. So now I'm looking at AUD cat on the daily time frame as usual. 
So the daily time frame we have something like this instant gas. So when you have something like this on the daily, and if you can check, we did break that level. You have something like this on the daily, so it's gonna happen when you break that level. Okay, I'm just gonna have these as my lowest low. And okay, from the daily, we have to head to the four hour, which is the 240, you know. So, just gonna be analyzing the previous market as we come, okay? Till the current, you know, guys. Um, this usually helps, you know, because sometimes I get the same patterns, um, repeating the, themselves and stuff, you know. So, on the four hour, I can't really say I see something here guys you know some some setups if you can't really just say it you know just like this one i know it has to push down but then the way it's moving you know like this is not the good way to say oh those are the setups that i can trade you know i can't trade something like this you know i personally can't you understand guys because like it has a lot of noise but then like you see because the movement is too choppy so we can come again and then like from there going down you understand you can just take the same format of which the market moves you know you can continue moving this way which is not a good way to move so in a setup was like this it's like a again a choppy setup you know so when your setup is choppy it means you can't trade it like stay away like don't even want to lose your money because if I say there's something I see there, they'll be lying, you know. Like, I don't see any structure here. I don't think this uh, position, one can, like, trade it now. No, nah, it's not tradable. You understand? Because it's not tradable for, for the sake of your safety. You know, they might be, I might see something there and there, but then I feel like for, for someone who's like new or someone who's willing to learn i can't show you a trade like this you know because i feel like this is a losing trade it's not a trade that one can like uh, make money from because you can see it guys it's too choppy you saw it you guys saw it you know okay so here's another one let's see here let's see what's cooking okay it's nzd so guys okay this is nzd um on the nzd all right this is the nzd on the nzd guys i have these do you understand so when i have that it's cool when i come here i have what i have these but it's still cool there's a break you understand so if it's cool if it's like that then okay i have these level here as my lowest level do you understand guys so now it's time to eat the chat you know so the situation is like this now okay we do have these it's nice again we do have what we do have these nice again so now guys now 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 we're in the current market you know analyzing the past doesn't really mean shit instance so now i'm here guys uh you know i need to think 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 man and the thing man and the thing and, and you know so you can see guys uh okay i have that now so now um, okay we did break so in structures like these now okay you know guys like learning never stops my having certain structure after the break and the structures like these Okay, the market is moving within this uh, zone, 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 zone. Once you break, you have a retest and you go down. You understand? So I feel like here we're just gonna form a, a what a correction, you know. So within that correction, that's when I'm going to capitalize. You understand, guys? It's man under the gold. You understand? You see what I mean? They don't call me man under the gold for nothing, guys. You see, you see what I mean, eh? when you come here, all right, okay, you see guys, you see how I had it, so it's not simple guys, you know, I'm waiting for, 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 for a good correction to happen there, you know, so within that correction, that's where I'm going to take my position, you know, 
So guys, uh, what I'm expecting is something like this again, you know. As you can see, the market did something like this. After doing something like this, we dropped. So who say price can't repeat the same thing? Understand? Who say price can't repeat the same thing? You see? So I'm more into this thing, guys. You know, like price can like repeat that thing again. If we go to the M15. That's when you can see that. Oh, this thing is usually something like this. You know, you need to be just just don't execute immediately. You just have to wait. Understand, cause if you can check it well, like just getting structures and such structures and stuff. You know. Which is a good thing, you know, it can never be a bad thing. Structures inside a structure, whatever, whatever, you understand? Because, so like, it can never be a bad thing. It can never be a bad thing, you understand? So, I mean, sometimes, just to like Excel, you could chew pattern inside patterns, but then that will be making the strategy difficult, you know? So, um, this is how we have it. You understand, guys? Shout out to all the hustlers out there, you know? Like, shout out to all the hustlers. Like, be do you man be the best you know like be be the best like don't listen to people what they say you know like always do what you gotta do unlike to anyone out there just keep pushing never give up i think it was me man under the coat i think i'm done i'll be just doing two videos of that i'll be dropping on the pre it's gonna be um nasdaq and usdt so for now guys i did currency so for like i'll do the usdt and whatever then we can like be nice you know it was me manando underscore the goat niggas depending on me i want some m's in my bed niggas you talking i know i got a lot in my plate niggas depending on me niggas like switching sides and i don't know why don't wanna hold out a level I'm too hot and I feel like a devil On the watches, I love me, you're best Too too hard and I'm taking your bed Spend a day and you told me she love me But I damn me, I'm looking for money Oh, I damn I'm looking for money And I'm chilling with gang, gang, gang And my team is so bad, bad.